first of all, Derek, congratulations. Uh, this movie was fast, fascinating, very interesting, very thrilling, very suspenseful. Um, when uh, preparing to to shoot this film, how did you approach uh, you know, directing the the models in order to for them to be so, I guess, so natural in in this environment. You know, at 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 the end of uh, I mean, re really, at the end of the day, they're they're playing a version of themselves, and that's what I told them. I mean, they you know, in in real life, they have different characteristics, but if you meet these girls in person, you you would think um, you're like, oh wow, yeah, you 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 kind of played yourself, and and I told them that I said, you know, don't worry so much about um, I, I I'm I'm building these characters off of you, you know, and I, and I want you to um. You know, I, I literally did build two characters off of two models that I was friends with. And as I was writing it, I thought about them. So, you know, Haley Lautenbach and Kira Santoro, before I even started writing the script, I was friends with them and I knew that I wanted them to be in these particular roles. Um, but yeah, the other actors and, uh, you know, I just said, look, you're playing a model. You are a real model in real life. You're not, you know, an actor trying to play a model. And I said, just be yourself, be natural. And uh you know, I, I it it's not like I just gave any of these girls these roles. There were you know hundreds of girls auditioned, and um, you know, and and uh, I I basically picked the ones that I thought would play the roles the best and and made the most sense. And what was also interesting is that they all put in the work to um, be the best best actors they can be. And um, you know, I'm I'm pretty sure every single one of them got an acting coach before, during, and and really, you know, this is their de debut feature and they wanted it to be um, perfect, so. Yeah, um, this story is, is fantastic. I I was really interested in the fact that uh, you took an extra beat for us to get it really, like, uh, involved with these models. Uh, th there's so much fun in the beginning before everything turns around on them. Uh, what, what, when did you make that choice to to allow us to have more um, more background with them? Yeah, I, I wanted I wanted there to be like a like an interesting turn, uh, you know, and, and it happens later than maybe most films, um, you know, because I, I wanted you to think, well, wait, what am I watching here? I thought this was a thriller, you know, and 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 then all of a sudden it happens, and I, I thought, you know, um, I, I feel like people when they watch films, especially in this genre. They're expecting something to happen, and it's usually something that happens around the fifteen minute mark, you know. And, and uh, I think with this film, you're going to be sitting there wondering when it's going to happen. When it does happen, you're going to be like, "Oh, okay, that's that's the moment." And and I think throughout there are little clues of, um, you know, different clues here and there that'll uh, keep you entertained. But yeah, it's a it's a good time, I think, until you know, shit hits the fan. <laughs> Definitely. Uh, there's so many aspects to this. Uh it's a kind of reality star type thing it's the model it's uh, instagram it's the house uh with so much going on uh how do you balance how these actresses um i guess how how you progress their story like uh, it seems like uh, the pacing was very very tight mm -hmm. yeah no i i mean i i've i wrote this script um you know during the pandemic and we also you know we were, we were supposed to go into production and then obviously everything shut down and then we basically pushed like another i think it was nine months or eight seven maybe six months seven months and we were one of the first uh films to to get going and we actually shot it all the way out in oklahoma and um you know we kind of the girls lived in a model house i mean cast and crew they had their own houses like you know just we all kind of uh we're very self-contained and um we were in this bubble and um you know but i think back to your question we you know i, I spent a lot of time with once i knew who the cast was which was kind of before um before we shot you know before we were out there i, I tweaked the script i mean I, I had six months to tweak the script and make it as tight as possible uh in most horror movies you only get uh one big twist coming but for this one you get uh you know a change uh halfway through and then you get another change when more characters are introduced um how difficult is it to boost the intensity every single time i mean you know i, I think uh 
you know, I, I, it's, 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 I just wanted to, I just wanted to make a film that, that, um, was enter you know, is entertaining. And I mean, I, I, I've, I've watched it many times and, you know, I, uh, you know, it, 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 to me, it goes by pretty fast. Like it's just, you know, you're constantly entertained. There's constantly something happening on the screen and, um, you know, that's, uh, yeah, I don't know if I answered your question, but that, that's, that's, um, yeah. Yeah, you, you did. Um, and, uh, you know, when people watch this movie, uh, what do you hope they get from it? What, what do you hope they, um, what, when do you hope that they get the jump scares? When do you hope that, you know, how, how do you hope that they're reacting to it as they're watching it? I mean, I, I, you know, I made this film to entertain first and foremost, you know, uh, you know, if you, if you like, if you want to watch beautiful people on the screen, this is a film for you. If you want to watch cool kills, this is a film for you. You know, if, if you like to shout and scream at the screen, this is the film for you. And, and, uh, you know, we don't, we didn't take ourselves too seriously. And, um, you know, I, I think at the end of the day, like, I just want to entertain, you know, and I, 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 uh, I believe we did that. You definitely did. Um, as, uh, as villains go, these, characters uh you you kind of have some empathy for them at, at certain points uh was this written into the script or this is this something that the actors brought to it it, it was definitely written in the script and something that i thought about for a long time i mean initially i was gonna go in you know one of my uh favorite films and i know people have um compared my film to this but the strangers you know where you don't you don't you don't meet the cat i feel like you don't meet the bad guys you know you, you don't get to you don't get to um hear them speak some I, mean, I know in some of the newer versions i think you do but i i wanted to really have these characters be people that you could um you know you can you can maybe relate to you can feel for you know and uh yeah i believe i did that especially with the masked characters definitely did uh well congratulations on this uh thank you very much for your time Oh, I appreciate it.